Hello, Jesse Draves here, Draves Archery, DravesArchery.com. I'm at the 2013 Matthews show up in Wisconsin Dells. Everybody's releasing their 2014 products, of course. Uh, Matthews Mission, they finally came out with a, a cranking device called the Silent Draw uh, RSD, correct? And uh, it's really compact, it's really lightweight, it's really cool. Uh, I got it figured out here. It's a really slick, slick item and it cranks super easy. So basically you're gonna buy the crank and then you gotta, and it'll come with this little piece and you can buy these separate if you wanna, if you got more than one crossbow. And what this piece, this cranking device does is it clicks on to this bottom old cocking rope. So it goes on here at an angle and then it goes on around to the other side and then this lever Whoop, sorry. This lever's got to be up, it goes over, and then this closes. So now this system's completely attached. You can leave it on there or you can take it off really easily. This is the this is your old style. We don't need that with this system, of course. Okay, so now we got a rope in here tight because we just shot it and it left on there. The trigger will come off of it. It's just got a simple little push pin which is really slick and then it just pop right off. So we are going to pull this rope out and cock this bow. Now this is their 400 uh, feet per second bow. It's brand new here for 2014 and it's 200 pounds. So this is the heaviest pull bow that they make. So just to give you an idea of how easy it is, we'll show you here. So to release this rope here, we got to pull this out. And just to make it easier, I'm gonna pull this off. And we pu push this over, this little piece, this little silver piece right here, and we'll pull it out just to keep it in the view of you here. Okay, now we go back to your standard block and tackle system. Hooks go up, they go around the orange piece. And of course I pulled out way too much We'll crank some in with my fingers here. It kind of self retracts to, to a certain point. It'll kind of suck itself in. So now we got the hooks hooks going up. Uh, we got a, the string ran around, around this new piece that we just added to it. We're, I'm right-handed, so I'm gonna put the, put the uh, crank on here. My name badge out of the way. That thing clicks on, so it's out of the way. And this will come with a little pouch so now, as you can see, two fingers, I'm cocking this 200 pound bow and I get tired, say my health condition won't allow me, I stop, that's fine, it just stays there. Very simple, I can stop whenever I want, it doesn't make a clicky noise, it doesn't move, it's super simple to do. And finally, when you get it all the way back, you'll hear it click. Okay, now it clicked. We're done. Almost done. So what we're going to do is we're going to crank it just a little bit more, shove this silver piece over so we can, this little stainless steel trigger piece here so we can let it down, let it down. We unhook it. Now we can leave this on and just crank this rope up tight behind it or under it if you want. Or you can very simply pull this lever up. This piece comes off you can throw it in your pack. Okay, so this bow's on safety. Uh, the cocking device is off. Everything there is super simple. It's super lightweight. It don't add a lot, of, a lot of weight to your bow. And then this is the 400 feet per second MXB 400. Very hard shooting bow, of course, 400 feet per second with a 400 grain arrow. But this cocking device is, I would say, definitely probably one of the slickest, if not the slickest cocking device I've ever seen. You can't let it slip out of your hand. It won't spin around and bite you. Um, you can let it down when, when you disengage this. If you, if you decide you don't want to cock it, you can back off of it. When you got this silver piece pushed over though, and you are trying to back it, then it will spin. So then, then you will have to be careful. So very simply, we're gonna put this back on goes on here at an angle this side here has to be up 
lever clicks, just that simple. You can see it's got a really tight fit to it. Uh, you can crank this thing up, like I said, where it's out of the way. You can put the lever in your pocket and the little pouch that it comes with. You can shoot the bow just fine with it on there. It doesn't interfere in where we're at if you want to leave it on. Or like I said, you can very simply just pop it off and put it in your pack or get it out of the way. So check it out. If you got any questions, give us a call at Draves Archery, DravesArchery.com. Uh, Matthews, again, came out with a wonderful deal with the mission line and a great cocking device with a very powerful bow. Thank you very much.